<laughs> and things looking good, which is always good. <clears throat> Things looking good, which is always good. Alright, slightly simple. Glad you could be here. Figured you, I mean, you pretty much said you would be here, but it's nice to see you are. Alright, slightly simple. Glad you could be here. Figured you, I mean, you pretty much knew that. You know, it's crazy. I I know this game came out in the 90s, but when I loaded the game, it just... This, this just looks like a late 90s game. <laughs> Let's just be real. Like, didn't have the Valve logo, didn't... It didn't, it didn't feel like a Valve game. It felt like an old, old Valve game, if that makes sense. Yeah, like, no sound or anything, just straight to this. Yeah. <laughs> so this is going to be an interesting experience. It might might be the oldest game I've ever streamed. <laughs> it, it seriously might be. So this ought to be interesting. Right. I think the Valve logo is in the files of Half-Life Blue Shift, but it doesn't show up in the game. Gotcha. It's just <laughs> find servers or create server. Are there even servers? There are. <laughs> I mean, I guess that's kind of a stupid question to ask, but still, it's just weird to think about this 20 year old game, over 20 year old game. <laughs> oh my, quite an experience. All right. Uh, yeah, I know it's kind of late, at least over here. It's 10 o'clock at night, which isn't too late, but whatever. <laughs> so, I guess I might as well just stop stalling and uh, get right into it. Let's just see what this is all about. Level of difficulty or the training room. We'll just go with easy. for the security and convenience of the Black Mesa Research Facility personnel. The time is 8.47 a.m. Current topside temperature is 93 degrees, with an estimated high of 105. The Black Mesa compound is maintained at a pleasant 68 degrees at all. I'm just gonna. Are there where the... Are there not captions? Huh. Are there not uh, subtitles? Hmm. All right. <laughs> This train is inbound from level three dormitories to sector C test labs and control facilities. If your intended destination is a high security area beyond sector C, you will need to return to the central transit hub in area nine and board a high security train. If you have not yet submitted your identity to the retinal clearance system, you must report to Black Mesa personnel for processing before you will be permitted into the high security branch of the transit system. Okay. <laughs> These graphic 
Due to the high toxicity of material routinely handled in the Black Mesa compound, no smoking, eating, or drinking are permitted within the Black Mesa transit system. Please keep your limbs inside the train at all times. Do not attempt to open the doors until the train has come to a complete halt at the station platform. In the event of an emergency, passengers are to remain seated and await further instruction. If it is necessary to exit the train, disabled personnel should be evacuated first. Please stay away from electrified rails and proceed to an emergency station until assistance arrives. You, you can just tell this is an old game just by all the graphics. It's all I mean, they still, I mean, I don't want to say they hold up because they clearly don't, but they still look presentable because there's that. very loudly when she's talking, don't they? A reminder to all Black Mesa personnel. Regular radiation and biohazard screenings are a requirement of continued employment in the Black Mesa Research Facility. Missing a scheduled urinalysis or radiation checkup is grounds for immediate termination. If you feel you have been exposed to radioactive or other hazardous materials in the course of your duties, contact your radiation safety officer immediately. Work safe. Work smart. Your future depends on it. Now arriving at Sector C test labs and control facilities. Please stand back from the automated door and wait for the security officer to verify your identity. Before exiting the train, be sure to check your area for personal belongings. Thank you, and have a very safe and productive day. Yeah, don't see my plan. Morning, Mr. Freeman. Looks like you're running late. Oh, screw you. <laughs> shift to crouch that's what I'm doing so Mr. Freeman 
I had a bunch of messages for you, but we had a system crash about 20 minutes ago, and I'm still trying to find my files. Just one of those days, I guess. They were having some problems down in the test chamber, too, but I think that's all straightened out. They told me to make sure you headed down there as soon as you got into your hazard suit. Oh, man, that audio quality. <laughs> oh, man, the audio quality. supposed to talk to you? No? Ah, hello, Gordon Freeman. It's good to see you. That audio quality, man. I'm Do not the biggest audio good? guy, but even I can tell how old that is. Okay, where am I supposed to go? Am I just supposed to keep going this way? Hello. <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Freeman. I got explicit orders not to let you through without your hazard suit on. Okay. Why do we all have to wear these ridiculous ties? Okay, yeah, they did mention hazards, so I guess that's what I gotta get. Hello there. Restrooms. Oh, break rooms. Cool. <laughs> Anything here? Yes. Someone has hidden my glasses again. <laughs> hidden my glasses. Freeman, ah. Why do we all oh. have to wear these ridiculous ties? Hmm. Press E on the microwave? Hold on, okay, I'll, I'll go back and do that. Yeah, I gotta, I remember, it's a, gotta remember, it's a Valve game, so I gotta make sure to interact with everything. Welcome to the HEC facility. Please remain seated until the Suit. I'm not crazy, right? There is music playing. Spammy. My God, what are you doing? <laughs> like you're in the barrel today. The barrel, huh? Doesn't sound like it's a good thing. Oh, okay. Black Mesa. Ooh, let's see. Sir, I've got to stay in my post. Okay. Alright. 
Ah, Gordon. Here you are. We just sent the sample down to the test chamber. We've boosted the anti-mass spectrometer to 105%. Bit of gamble, but we need the extra resolution. The administrator is very concerned that we get a conclusive analysis of today's sample. I gather they went to some lengths to get it. They're waiting for you, Gordon, in the test chamber. In the test chamber. <laughs> be deviating a bit from standard analysis procedures today, Gordon. Yes, no? but with good reason. This is a rare opportunity for us. This is the purest sample we've seen yet. And, potentially, the most unstable. Now, now, if you follow standard insertion procedures, everything Please, is fine. Please, leave me open. I don't know how you can say that, although I will admit that the possibility of a resonance cascade scenario is extremely unlikely. Gordon doesn't need to hear all this. He's a highly trained professional. We've assured the administrator that nothing will go wrong. Uh, Famous last words. Yes, you're right. Gordon, we have complete confidence in you. Well, go ahead. Let's let him in now. Okay. <laughs> nothing will go wrong. Absolutely nothing. <laughs> Hey, Slender Slayer. Thanks Testing. for joining. Testing. <coughs> Everything seems to be in order. Okay. All right, Gordon. Your suit should keep you comfortable through all this. The specimen will be delivered to you in a few moments. If you would be so good as to climb up and start the rotors, we can bring the anti-mass spectrometer to 80% and hold it there until the carrier arrives. How things going? Things been going good. <laughs> yeah. Just as standard as it can get. Mayday, mayday, 
Man down. Man down. Oops. <laughs> See you next Sunday after that.
Face of fire, do not use elevators. I don't see a fire, I see a bunch of explosions. Wait, was there someone in there? Sorry. <laughs> oh, hey, this thing has relevance. Sweet. <laughs> <laughs> Still for too long, can I? Can we talk about that? Yeah, that's the yeah new Half Life game. Yeah, that's totally. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! What the world are you? What the world? What is? What is no, why? Why is this happening? Why? Why is anything? Why? Why is anything? Why? <laughs> why is any? Why? I saw that. I was, I was hacking. I just saw that. Like some sort of tutorial would be nice, please. That, like, you can't just leave me a fee on everything. Shouldn't have to rely on a stream chat to figure out how to play this game. There was a tutorial you just did. I would think that'd be part of the main story, not like I would think a tutorial would be part of the main game. Yeah, what, what kind of 
game like this has an optional tutorial that's separate from the main story. That just that makes no sense to me. That that should not be a thing. for trying to play. <laughs>
how it totally thought to look there. Now what? Our doors are open by walking in the <laughs> That's not confusing at all. Jeez. I don't know whether I'm just stupid or this is very bad game design. Probably, probably the former, but... Stands are expected by nice. Well, <laughs> and, well, there's a reason stuff like this doesn't exist anymore because it mechanics like this don't exist anymore because it's stupid. <laughs> Makes absolutely no sense. This for you to find the FEF sounder at the time. Well, yeah, keyword at the time. Half-Life games are free right now for because of Half-Life Alex coming out here. Yeah, Half-Life 2 came out at the same time as Team Fortress 2 and Portal, so I expect it to be somewhat better. Why does 
missed that. Yeah, no, thank you. Well, there goes our grant money. I certainly hope you know what you're doing. Not really. <laughs> I really don't. Yes, you did. <laughs> well then. Yeah, I actually have all the Half-Life stuff. I got them, I bought them all a while ago. It was like a bundle for Steam. Uh, yeah. Yes, it was just some bundle. It had like all the Half-Life games and Team Fortress Classic, and I think one other thing, but yeah, I just bought them all then for like a really cheap price. Yeah, that's normal. There's a... And one of the people watching is me, by the way. So, because I've got this stream pulled up on my computer, so one of those people is me. Oh. I don't feel dumb to buy that I bought them. It came out. It this we're talking over a year ago, almost two years ago, when I got them. I just never played them. <laughs> Shoot the door open? Is that what I'm supposed to do? What's funny is uh, buying the orange box gave me proof of purchase hat in TF2, which normally you only get for buying the game for. I mean, yeah, you did technically buy the orange box, which means you did buy P TF2. <laughs> so, that's fair. Yeah, imagine paying for a free game. How do I... How do I get in here? <laughs> Can I not get in here? Is that, is that what it's telling me? Yeah, this is what I mean.
Switch. No. Got this gaming PC. Why would I have one? Only thing I really play on vis that play on Mac are visual novels because you can't really call those games, and they still run well. There's a broken window near the new office. Wait, is this actually? Duck meal. Huh, sure enough. I guess I figured I had to shut the electricity off first. Yeah, I know how to port the flashlight. So look at that. You must have... Ay, ay, ay. Oh, this? anyone else who comes by and we might stand a better chance if we team up yeah so thank you <laughs> Jeez.
something I can use. Say as you One health at a time. Lovely.
if not, if you don't mind, I think I'd rather... <laughs> I think one playthrough of this game is enough, if you don't mind. <laughs> uh, apparently, people are entertained by people failing the game, so... Might as well. I hear something. Yeah, I hear it too, buddy. Well, the dimensional breach is definitely transmitting organic matter. It appears they can Who is responsible for this mess? Good question. What the hell are you doing down here? Get topside! I hear troops are coming in to save us. I'll be having to do my head for all my parts. Okay, why not? Didn't want to die alone anyway. This feels more like a horror game than an FPS. Horror in nature and horror in gameplay. <laughs>
used to play T Fortress 2 because I keep hitting 3 to activate my menu weapon, which is not how it works here. Actor for Scout Hunter. Yeah, the Chili Destiny. Yeah, he's on. Thank <laughs> you. 
take much more of this. If you don't count on the cavalry finding it down here, head for the surface. Elevators are out of order, but we can still climb. That would be nice right about now. Oh, and I'm back here. Lovely. Now where do I go? Don't worry. I am a doctor. I'll stay here. Glad to oblige a fellow scientist. I'm going to stay here and wait for my colleagues. or whatever it is. Ah, Freeman. I see you are. That's all I did. I just went up and it pushed me back and bounced me. Good old source engine for you.
are from the anonymous material direct Jump! I I did. I I I hit it. I I did it. <laughs> Thank you. Please. Can't necessarily give you a file. A fellow scientist. No, I don't record and stream at the same time. Freeman, I have thought you'd never really alive. found a reason to record and stream at the same time. <laughs> take up because the stream is on here. Well, with Sans, it was intentionally difficult. <laughs> Good, I haven't heard that one a bajillion times, ever.
points off it when I touch it. <laughs> oh. Oh my god! 
started with more than eight health points game. That would, don't you think that would be nice? Don't you think that would be humanly possible? Thank you. 
quits. I, I am not having fun anymore. I, I am. I am not. I'm not. <sighs> All right. Well, that was a that was an experience, I guess. <laughs> All right. Well, sorry that was not. I mean, maybe it was entertaining for you guys. I don't know, but. <sighs> All right. Yeah. Not sure if I'll ever play it again because I'm. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe with more preparation, but. Yeah. Anyway, calling it quits. Thanks for watching, I guess. <laughs>